Yeah. Okay, guys, we're back uh, with Michael <laughs> Beaver. <laughs> right, mate, 15, 15 to 16 fights with Calsop, Thai yeah. boxing. Yeah, thinking, yeah, yeah. And you've just told me you're going to have a crack at MMA. Yeah, man, that's the, uh, okay. that's the goal. Switching across. Yeah, I mean... I you going to do both still? Uh, is, I do feel like I've got unfinished business with Muay Thai. Like, I do, I think, in the future, uh, I might sign another one, but to focus on my MMA for now. Yeah. And if a good opportunity comes up, I'll take a Muay Thai fight, definitely. For sure. I've got the skills there. That so, I just need to so you're, you're still training with Aaron? No, I haven't not, been there not, not, not much with Aaron? No, I haven't been there Okay. Yeah. So, you're training with Ben a bit for MMA? Yeah, yeah, training. With Ben Vickers down at... Yeah, Ben yeah. Vickers down at the clinic, yeah. And you're going to fight on a tournament? Yes, yeah. Okay. Good, yeah, man. It's going to be good. You ready? I will be, yeah. Um, um, okay. Mu Thai is your base. Yeah. How much wrestling and jiu-jitsu have you done? And um, my wrestling, I've actually really enjoyed my wrestling. Um, okay. Getting much better at my wrestling. Um, Jiu Jitsu, I'm um, working that as well, especially stuff that I need for the short term. And then as I'm working that, I'm starting incorporating all the stuff which will help me in the long term, but I need what I need for the spider for the moment. So, okay. um, mainly, mainly just directing my wrestling. I'm enjoying, I really enjoy wrestling. So. Cool. It's awesome. tiring though. It works here. It's, a different, yeah, it's yeah. a different fitness again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, I'm not getting training enough, but it's a totally different fitness. I, I only do Jiu Jitsu now to, for my health, but. Yeah. It is a struggle, it's a different set of muscles yeah. again, and it everything, be completely different, different cardio, yeah. different cardio for, for the jiu-jitsu and the wrestling side yeah. of things. It's funny when I'm getting them rolling with someone and they are, uh, they're just, I was like, how is this person not running on steam, they're just completely controlling me, and then I did a Muay Thai class and first round of pads and they're already tired. So okay, yeah. now, in, uh, you've always fought pretty light, mind you, you're only young, so yeah. sort of, uh, Around the 60 kilo mark as, yeah. a, as a kid, 17, 18, 19 yeah. years old. As you get older, you fill out. Yeah. You don't look like 61 right now. You uh -huh. look like you've, you've filled out a bit. Yeah. What, what weight you're fighting at? Um, MMA? Fighting 72. So. 72. Yeah. Is that an agreed weight then? Because you don't think it's a weight bracket in MMA. That must 70, be. 77 is the uh, weight they bracket. Still, they saw something like catch weight, so I don't know if that's what okay. it is. Yeah, yeah. yeah well, it's two, two, you both catch weight is when. You both agree on a lot. You're different weights. Mm -hmm. There's a catch weight. Yeah. Um, but that's just an agreed weight then, isn't it? Yeah, 72. Because I think it's 67 for featherweight and then I think world weight 77. So you're right in between it at the moment. Yeah. Too. But you, as you get older, you fill out. Yeah. Well, I'm not, I'm not, like I said, I'm not cutting much weight for the spider. I don't think I'm cutting really anything. So okay. going used to cutting a lot of weight for Muay Thai because you can. I don't think you can really, I don't think it's healthy at all to cut weight. But, Too much. But even with wrestling, I mean, mm -hmm. I'm like, Ref like all MMA, like any kind of grappling. I can imagine cutting weight and grappling and striking. It's just wrecky. It's a lot. Of, I used to run when I was boxing and kickboxing. I used to run an hour in the mornings and train two hours, four nights a week, yeah. and then go sparring on a Sunday morning. Yeah. Just a box pro. I mean, how much uh, time can you put in? I mean, there's all the discipline: yeah. jiu-jitsu, wrestling, boxing, Thai boxing. Yeah, you've got to even out your time. And, and your strength and conditioning work, yeah. running and, and power training or whatever. So you've got five or six disciplines in there, finding the time. I mean, you're yeah. a PT, so you're pretty fit anyway. Yeah, yeah. No, Are like you balancing that. all the time? You... It's, I'm um, finding it to be good. You know, sometimes I think I should do more of the things that I should do for a fight, but you know, like, all right, I'll do more attack because you're comfortable or something like that. But, um, yeah, it's... You never really, I don't, it'll be a lot longer to master everything because you've got to spread it out. Absolutely. Um, so. Almost but, need to be full time training. But I think, yeah, well, that's it. And I think you've got to, as long as you're fit, I reckon, as long as you're training multiple kind of fitness, not just long distance running, but you're doing incorporating sprints, incorporating, you know, doing different training, doing your wrestling, doing your stand up sparring, you're getting all the fitness you need. Yep. Um, so like now this week coming up, I'm going to be doing um, you know, my road work in the mornings followed by a, probably an hour and a half, two hour session, and then sort of then training again at night. So I'm trying to try to do two a day. Yeah. Um, this upcoming week, my, my three week out. Week Any sponsors is, yet? Hmm? Any sponsors on board? I've got one sponsor, um, Harakiri. So it's it's a small one, I don't think they're that well known, but they're, they're doing quite a bit of projects at the moment. Um, Adam Jakes, he, I work with him, uh, he's, I think he used to do 
be one of the instructors at AMA. Okay. Um, so he does jiu-jitsu and he's got one of his friends which also runs company with him. It's mainly just um, May gear, jiu-jitsu gear, all that kind of stuff. Okay, they're a shop, are they? Yeah, or yeah. Or just an online, online, online shop? Online at the moment, I think. Online shop, selling, selling uh, apparel. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay. Yeah, apparel, yeah. Yeah, all your equipment and whatever. Cool, mm. sweet. So, long-term future, you think MMA is your goal? Yeah. You're, just, you're just itching to get in there? Yeah, well, I mean, actually, before I started Muay Thai, my plan was MMA. So, okay. a lot of people don't know that, so it was... Um, yeah, I want to begin to MMA club at the moment. I don't know at the time. I don't know from anywhere. It was like the arena which I went to and fight, like, get what I wanted out of that place. And then a friend told me about Kowsok when I was working, and um, I went and checked it out and fell in love with it. So yeah. I mean, the plan was only a few Muay Thai fights and doing MMA, but I'm just, I love Muay Thai too much. And I was yeah. like, no, nah, I've got a, oh, a few more fights, a few more fights. Okay. So you find as a you'll be an amateur the first fight out. Yeah. So you'll have no, you'll have no elbows. Yeah. You okay with that? Yeah. No elbows? Oh, uh, yeah. So, but you'll have knees to the head. Yeah. Uh, um, up kicks will be in, be yeah. am, even though amateurs. Yeah. Okay. Sweet. And your and you're tie boxing background. Yeah. Excellent. So, your future, you think your future will be MMA? Yeah. No, yeah. I mean. And you're only, you're only going to get heavier as you, as you fill out being a 20 year old. You're 77 kilos is the world of weight. I reckon, uh, yeah. Weight I can see myself being around there. Yeah. Years, yeah. You, you won't be. You won't be lighter than that, really. I mean, you get it. I mean, you can cut, but you're still growing, so you're yeah. still filling out. You know. I don't you want to start cutting large amounts of weight anymore. Okay. Done with that. Okay. So, so you're working as a PT where? Uh, well, I'm PTing at the uh, the clinic, so I've got a few more Thai clients there. I'm working at another gym as well. Okay. This is. I'm not. I'll be PTing there for starting from next month. Okay. So I am a qualified personal trainer, but yep. I'm not PTing them yet. I'm just doing some admin stuff. Just a uh, just few things I need to sort out before I start repeating. So cool. um, now I think I'm ready to start training people. So All right. yeah. well, that's great, and I wish you the best of luck. And yes, I might see you in the middle. Yeah, that'll be good. Take care. Yeah. Thank you. Very good. Yeah. Thank you.